For Leslie Coburn to be nominated, it took over a year and more than 50,000 miles. How are you? Good to see you. Hi. You've got, you've got a lot of support. Thank you. Hi there. It took convincing nearly 4,000 Democrats to spend hours voting in caucuses. Thank you. And it took standing before a diverse crowd of over 1,200 people in Albemarle County and taking the time to thank them all. Let me say that I'm very proud to be here and thank you all. For the Republicans to find their nominee, it took six self-nominated candidates standing in front of a silenced audience of 150. An audience with just one person of color. I have been sickened by the gamesmanship I've seen in this room in the last hour. It's despicable. It took spewing enough hate speech to last three hours. Well, I can tell you it's common sense, folks. Boys don't belong in the girls' bathroom. I hate those sons of guns. <laughs> with no exceptions, and I mean none, rape, incest alike, and I don't care if that's controversial to you, it's easy to claim a victim if you're a female. And it took whatever wheeling and dealing was necessary to persuade 37 Republican Party bosses to vote in a secret ballot. For once in our friggin' lives, let's clothesline somebody on a Red Rover game, because that's what I did as a seven-year-old. I want everybody to be like a seven-year-old and clothesline progressives in Red Rover. Thank you very much. I'm Deborah Riggleman. Please vote for me. Two very different visions of democracy in America. Aren't you happy to be voting Democratic this year?